Hello everyone, this is Spell and I'm bringing you a Clamor game which I really enjoyed. We have Stabby from Surreal Killers as the GLA and on the other side we have ATF the game being the laser general. And I thought this was a pretty good game so I wanted to cast it for you guys to enjoy. We have the game as it appears to be going for the pretty standard dual supply. I would be surprised if he wouldn't sell his command center. Meanwhile we have Stabby going looking at his build order he might go for a quick all capture because he likes to do that on his map. Some there could be a barracks here but it seems like uh, the game didn't box his uh, doses uh, correctly that could hunt him in the end. Yeah, yeah, Stabby is definitely going for the old capture. Let's see how that works out for him. He's getting the terrorist to deny any dozer drop, which is nice play. We have the game getting a dozer to make sure if there's any worker here, he can just drive it over. Oh, surprisingly, no boxing from the game. All right, might be a dozer hunt game. Axel, eat your heart out. Yeah, we have a fake uh, arms dealer from Stabby, so it's a bit delayed. He doesn't have the money to upgrade it yet, so he will probably do so shortly. A quick Humphrey from um, the game, he's gonna deny the worker and he's also gonna deny the rebel I think, so that hurts Stabby a lot, not the best start, well played the game. He might succeed in getting the other role though, but the start is better for the game. Let's see what this Humphrey will achieve. are a lot of RPGs though, so it might not... No, he's, he's just gonna go back, but is he too late? I think there should be some... Yeah, there's the first action. Other than the Humphy that is earlier. Yeah, that's one dead Humphy. Alright, I'm gonna assume he's gonna try to finish the tunnel here now. But the game is obviously aware of this and he's immediately sending three Humphys and ambulance to it to clear it up gonna have to decide will he get the technical or will he get the tunnel he's gonna go for the tunnel Let's see yeah the tunnel is gonna be destroyed some harassment on the Chinooks there's another technical he's gonna destroy the power oh he shouldn't have done that he lost the technical for nothing that's a shame meanwhile the RPGs are gonna deny this uh, mining time so that's something, he's gonna get the garrison, which is pretty smart. Kinda making up for losing his technical for nothing, basically. Meanwhile, Stabby is getting the all. he's getting some technicals. He's probably preparing for some offense shortly, cause I'm pretty sure he doesn't want the USA to get too many humpies, cause then it's gonna be really hard. Keep in mind, um, the game is only on one dozer at this point, because he lost the one trying to uh, deny the all capture here. So if Stabby gets this dozer, it's gonna be a dozerless the game, which will make it very hard for him. Uh, the rebel is uh, being evacuated, so he can get the other roll, but it seems a bit slow, so maybe the game can deny it with his humpy. Depends if he saw it or not. I think he saw it because he seems to be going. No, no. Yeah, maybe he is. Yeah, yeah. He should be clearing it now. Oh, he's a bit uh, hesitant to do so. All right, he decides to just let it be. Make up your mind. <laughs> Get a rebel or don't. Come on. Yeah, he decides to just do nothing. He had the time to deny it easily. I think he was afraid for the incoming ter terror or something. Because he really wants to keep his last dozer alive. Meanwhile, we have five full Humphies from the game, not too bad. He's gonna deny map control for Stabby, get, get the tunnel so he can't get a third supply up that quickly. But meanwhile, Stabby is going on the attack. He's going for it. Game notices some time. His map awareness is uh, nice. Very good. 
There we go. Oh, his last dozer. Is he gonna lose it? Yeah, he's gonna lose the dozer. Oh, and also, he's gonna get the barracks. Also, no more ND production as well. Rager, last bag. All that stuff. Let's see. The more uh, Humpy's um, Steppy managed to destroy right now, the better for him. Because the game can only rely on his uh, Humpy spam now. Tauli. I think he should just go for it. But Steppy is prepared. He's preparing the defense. He knows. He, ha he just has to hold on. But first, there's a lot of Humpies. That's easier said than done. Worker for Stabby. There comes the Humphies, let's see what they will achieve. Now there's a tower here with RPGs in it, so that's gonna be annoying. Not that much since he's dodging it very nice. Stabby is also preparing a terror technical, but yeah, the barracks is gonna get destroyed in a minute, so that might get delayed. Uh, the game uh, notices the defense spam from Stabby now, so he knows it's gonna be hard, it's not gonna be easy to break through. A lot of technicals as well from Stabby. I think he's gonna try to come from behind to surround them, which is the clever thing to do. Yeah, there he comes. We should just drive in there. Oh, kills two humpies, three humpies, three humpies. I think that's okay for him because he has a lot of defense and it's gonna be hard with just four humpies to break through. There is some reinforcements, however, but keep in mind the game has no barracks, so and he should be mining with this. So, he's getting a lot of drones which will help, but it's not MDs. It would have been way harder for Stabby if, if the game could produce uh, missile defenders. The Buck is getting up, that's nice. So, if Stabby Micros is correct, he should be able to hold. Two hunters going down. But also a lot of tunnels are going down as well. That's like four hunties I think. It's gonna be number five. This one. Oh. The game is getting behind this, which is pretty smart because the bookies are gonna have a hard time to target these hunties. Uh, Steppy uh, realizing that and he's gonna sell his uh, arm stealer just so he has some more uh, space to uh, fire with his buggy but of course the game also just repositioned so he's, he is gonna lose another Humphy though which is a shame for him because also the Humphys the last and these are here so I think this might actually be there are still some here but there's not a lot of him of uh, missile defenders anymore around so oh another Humphy nearly going down the armor out Damage, getting the missile defender, sniping one. Is he gonna? No, he's not gonna get Jarman. Gets another room feed, just pop so he can heal. Nice play, but still, it is gonna be hard because there are only four buckies and there are so many Humphies coming because the game knows it's now or never, he just needs to go for it. I think this is a bit of a bait from Step, just building a barracks so the Humphies can get out of position and it kind of works because there's one Humphie left. Will he get another one? No, the charging the reloading takes too long. Meanwhile, Stabby is getting a black market. I'm gonna assume that he wants to get the rocket upgrade for the buggy so he can some, do some more damage. Yeah, Humphie's being cleared here, but there's, there's another six Humphies. It's a pretty intense game to be honest, there's so much action, I like it. Uh, you would say uh, all Stabby has to do is just terror attack his war factory so the game can't produce any units anymore, but the problem is that... is that the game has, has vision everywhere, so he's not gonna be surprised and he's, 
just gonna keep Stabby under pressure, so he can't afford to do stuff like that. He's just gonna have to hold tight here. There's no terror attack coming through. As a matter of fact, Stabby doesn't even have a barrack at this point. He does have, still has one oil, so that's good for his economy. I think the game should have uh, destroyed that, but then again, if you would waste time on destroying the oil, not that it's really wasted time, but. It will give Stabby a lot of time to get his defense up, get more, maybe get the uh, rocket upgrade for the bird, nice like micro there, nice tunnel pop, the opposite of a Farco pop. Oh, well played, well played. Killing a lot of Humphies there. There's a big uh, veteran 3 ranger walking around. Oh, <laughs> this is actually pretty annoying for Stabby, because he has. He doesn't appear to have any RPGs or quads to clear this. Yeah. Now comes the quads, so it will be cleared now, but still it will take a while. Meanwhile, a uh, Humphy just died for Stabby. Tried to build a supply here, but he had to cancel. He saw the Humphies were coming for it anyway, so there's no points. He's gonna hide the worker here, smart. I think the game might be going to destroy the all now. Yes, but Stabby noticed it, so he just uh, the game notices the buggy and just goes back. Meanwhile, Stabby is uh, level three, so he's getting a command center. The game is level four, but he has no barracks and no command center, so he's not gonna get snipers, and he's definitely not getting a e ten strikes. So he's gonna have to do with his army, which consists of mostly, uh, well, basically, Bumpies, Taulifis, and drones, and two ambulances. He is however mining everywhere, I think it's not just for mining but also to check if Stabby is trying to regain his supplies But I think at this point Stabby realized that he's not getting, gonna get the supplies He's gonna have to hold on and hope to get maybe level 5 uh, Or get a lot of money with the cash bounty so he can get some more black markets He, he is uh, getting another one so that makes his total of 2 oh, There we go, there we go Oh, the, oh, the buggies were stuck. He, he lost three or four buggies. That could be used. So this could be the game. Game. Uh, the game, game. However, there's also a lot of Humvees dying still. So it's gonna be close. Only two buggies for Stabby. That's not a lot. But only three Humvees from the game, which also isn't a lot. I think he's gonna deny the black market, that's annoying for Stabby, that's for sure. Yeah, he's gonna get denied. Oh, sneaky ambulance getting into the workers line, that's annoying. Well played. A veteran Rehumpy, but it might be destroyed now. Yeah, he's not gonna survive. There's also a palace here and it's, I'm pretty sure it's filled. So. so he was dead anyway, whether it was by buggies or by the rockets from the palace. <laughs> Still the ambulance, it's it's hard to get rid of, it's like fungus. Oh, so micromanagement went there, he's gonna lose it now. Yeah, at this point you say obviously Stabby has the advantage because he has an all and he can just sit back and and chill for a bit, get the buckies up and he just has to prepare for the upcoming Tauli attack, but on the other side, Stabby doesn't really have that much units so he's gonna have to be careful because if he miss micros or if he messes up a fight then it could still be GG what's this oh there's a sneaky RPG over there there comes another self of Humphies or don't they He's, he's gonna drop, he's gonna try to drop to Humphies. I don't think that's gonna work because a lot of stinger sites. But let's see. Oh, and he, he's gonna do a big attack with his main army and in the meantime he's gonna try to drop from behind, I think. But, yeah, the Chinook is kinda damaged already to start with, so he just lost 
one or two Humvees for nothing basically. The game has uh, both reinforcement pads, so he is gonna he's getting some laser things behind it. Would actually be kind of funny if he gets too many of them and he would be out of power because of them. So. <laughs> we'll see if the game gets to there. The train is a bit bad, so the buggy won't get the only there. Is, one is gonna die now, however, and the cash bounty is another additional income from Savvy. So. Not only is he uh, is he getting promotions by killing units, but he's also getting a lot of money for it, so, which in turn will allow him to get some more black market, some more defense, anything to just basically hold on now. Ah, the laser tanks getting sniped. There's no point from Stabby in getting them since he has no power. So. That would do no him no good. Meanwhile, a badass. Uh, Three star pilots over here. I think Stabby should destroy this. It, it gives a lot of XP and he needs to get level 5. He's level 4, which is pretty decent, but he needs. I think he needs the Anthrax bomb, maybe the Sneaky Tunnel to finish off uh, his last buildings. The game appears to be going maybe for the Ols now. Counter attack. Oh, there's a venture, but he was alone. So that's 300 easy money for Stabby. Thank you, he's thinking. Yeah, he's getting the Earls. Alright, it's about time. The laser tank also helping out from the right. Yeah, there comes the Earl. There goes the Earl, I should say. It's getting destroyed. Meanwhile, Stabby is almost on three black markets. So he's definitely preparing for the late game and that's a big compliment also to the game because he's giving so, so much pressure to Stabby and his base that he never managed to get up a third supply or or any of that. He just has to defend all the time. He is getting the laser tank over here which gives him some XP. I think he's getting the reinforcement pad right now which also gives a lot of XP so that's smart. And also no more annoying laser tanks. At least from this one, we still have this one here. There we go. Thank you. Oh, but there's a big army. Let's see, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. It's like 15 Humvees and 2 ambulances. It's a huge army and look at all the drones. The Hellfire drones especially. That could still do a lot of damage, especially if he manages. Oh, there's a beacon. Stas? I, I have no idea. I think it has to do with the tower and it's a Russian memory thing. But a Russian uh, viewer can maybe explain it to me I, because I'm not 100% sure. There comes the buggies. One Humphies goes down, but is he gonna lose the Humphies? Because if he does, it could be GG right here. No, he should be microing them alright for now. Oh, or isn't he? He's gonna lose one, he's gonna lose two. Two buggies gone, alright. Oh, and the armor, the army is clearly out of position. He's gonna lose the armor, he's gonna lose another buggy. Still pretty close. Ooh, the stinger side also helping out a lot though. Should target the low HP one obviously, is he doing that? I hope he does. He's just targeting any of them I think. I don't think he's doing manually. Another Humpy's got down. And it looks like Stabby's gonna hold for now. But the game isn't giving up. He's gonna destroy this tunnel. I think no, he's gonna go for the buggy. Oh he's gonna lose the catch of three one. Oh he's not. Pretty close though. Gonna pop risky, but ooh, he's destroying a lot. Oh, he did last one out though. This is, uh, I think, this is a very good game. I hope it's also very fun. But more bucks from Stevie being added to the mix. Level level three healthy is gonna be destroyed right now. Level three bucky still here. Very cool, the red rocket. 
Oh, but th there's even more. There's... These players don't give each other any time to breathe, especially the game. Of course he has to, because he... The moment he's gonna stop putting pressure on Stevi, I think, it's probably the moment that he lost. But is he getting through? Especially with uh, level 3 buggy, it's gonna be hard. Another bug to go down. Another one, only three buggies left. That's a Sparkins now. That's it. Oh, that's a miss micro, but Stabby doesn't want to give up on the three markets. The armor snipes one. Is he getting away this time? It appears that he is. I think he might destroy one. Yeah, now go back. Oh, but Miss Micro from the game. I think he's gonna lose something here. Yeah, he does. Yeah, and meanwhile, the, the army of the game is... It's getting smaller and smaller, but... It's not like Stabby has a big army as well. Uh, I mean the game, sorry. Both of them are pretty small on army. Also, the laser tanks are being added to the mid, so that work very well against the quads and the scorps uh, that we've been producing. The armor uh, is probably gonna snipe one of those to make it a bit easier, but still. Some nice popping with the buggy. The game has to get through. Oh, that's, uh, <laughs> that buggy didn't achieve much. Nora Hook is going down. Again, nice nice tunnel popping, but if this tunnel goes down, which appears it is, there is no defense for these black markets, and that's half of the economy of Stabby, so he really doesn't want to lose this. The laser tanks getting sniped. Some buckies are going out. More even more Humphies, Tau Humphies incoming. Oh you can't afford to lose it, don't. We lost both of the buggies. This could be a disaster for him. Not a buggy, but will he lose it straight away? I think he... No, he... He keeps it alive, but even so... He has Yarma though, so... He should just snipe the Lazy Tank? Or maybe the Humphy, because if he snipes the Humphy, he could stay alive. No, no, he's not staying alive. He died. And I think the game realized by now that... If he just keeps spamming and denies the production, he could win this. But... Yeah, he can only produce from one war factory. And oh, the anthrax, yeah. There's an anthrax on the war factory. I don't think he destroyed anything, because... Th there appear to be no wreck ages, but... It's gonna be hard for him to produce for now. So basically, all Stabby has to do right now is clear this. However, it's only Bucky she has, and they're they're behind here, so it's hard to hit them. Luckily for Stabby, the game missed micros this bit, so he's gonna lose. Oh. oh! I don't think Stabby has any army right now. But having said that, there's only one Humphy here from the game in his base. It is a level 3 one, so it's gonna destroy the black market, but yeah, Yarm is just gonna snipe it, so he, he's he's holding again, it's a very close game, I think. Oh, <laughs> the Ambo wants non nothing to do with his terrorists. Uh, Yarm is back though. I don't think uh, neither of the players played really perfect, but I also think it's one of the games that made it a better replay because of it, if you know what I mean. Because it was very close, because there were a lot of <laughs> mistakes, but that also made it pretty entertaining. There's a sneaky tunnel, but yeah, the game has enough to clear up and I don't think Steph is gonna risk popping here. No, that would be a far go pop. So that's the right decision. and. It's not like Stabby has a lot to pop anyway. He is however getting the the Humphies uh, 
which Jarman sniped, so to add it to his own army, which is the clever thing to do. Oh, there's another laser tank being sniped. He's obviously not getting those, because no power. Oh, some action, yeah. <laughs> some Tauli versus Tauli versus Hunty action over here. Another one going down. Oh, no, don't lose Hunty's, you can't afford that. Yeah, I think it's it's getting to the point where the game is in trouble. But he's not giving up. I you have to appreciate that. He, he's going for it. Clears up another attack from the game. And every unit that gets killed is more money. So more markets, more defense, more buggies, you name it. Interestingly, there's no uh, no damage upgrade on the rocket jets, but I think that's also because Debbie didn't have a lot of time to just spend money other than on markets and buggies, because there's so much pressure on him. Oh, big drop coming from the game. I think that might be, yeah, that's probably gonna be all the Tau VCS, except the two in his base. There they go. Stabby quickly cancelling the black market here, because he knows he's gonna get destroyed anyway. And how will he respond? He could attack here, but it would be risky, because it's hard to fire from there. And No, he's not gonna do that. He, he used the stealth uh, promotion. So these units are actually stealthed and he, Oh, he's gonna go for an attack on his main base. He's gonna go for it. Destroys one immediately. But still three Taulis here. Gonna kill another one. Nice micro, keeping the buckets in the back. Yeah, well played, well played. It's gonna be a bit of a base trade, but I don't think the game can get this balance. That's the problem for him. Yeah, Stabby is trying to get the War Factory for the game, so that would destroy his promotion, so no mortality for him. It would be over then. Yeah, this is War Factory, but... Yeah, how is the game gonna respond to this? He's gonna bring most of the Humphies back. He's gonna keep one here, with his friends the Snipe Laser Tank. Oh, he's gonna drop here. Ooh. But Bucky's are too quick for that. The idea is nice, but yeah. Yeah, so basically this is the last army the game has with some snipers. And he still has some missile defenders in garrison, which he could have evacuated to make his Humvees attack a bit stronger maybe, but... He didn't decide to go for it. The armor is probably gonna snipe one of those, preferably the three star one. Yeah, there he he's coming, there he is. Maybe the snipe is on. Oh, oh he alright. He snipes the other one it but it doesn't matter. It's Stabby has a more than capable army to deal with this. Because, yeah, this is all the game has, but still, he's still not giving up. He's still going for it. But yeah, he, he should know by now that it's over. A lot of 3-star units in this game, uh, by the way. Another one. Very nice. There we go. Get sniped though. Last two Humphies. Yeah, they're, they're shooting at the uh, command center, but... I think uh, there's a fat lady singing somewhere. If you know the, <laughs> the saying, it ain't over till the fat lady sings, I think it's over. Even if Stabby loses all of his buckies, it would still, I think, be his game because he's not gonna destroy the palace. The armor snipes Dunphy. There, there comes the buggies. 
get the laser tank, get the other laser tank, and that's the last of the army from the game. There's literally nothing left right now. So, cost the GG, well played, nice game. I hope you, you guys enjoy the cast, enjoy watching. And uh, if enough people watch it, I will do a lot more cast because uh, I'm more into streaming and casting at this point than in actually playing. So I hope you guys have a nice day and I hope to see you around. Bye bye.